guys, I'm back to do a lesson for uh, Lost Paraguayos from Rod Stewart. Um, not sure what album this is on. I know this is on like a, well, it was like a Rod Stewart anthology kind of thing that I used to have. And uh, I believe it has Ron Wood playing guitar on it. So I. Uh, always liked this song, I just wanted to share it with you all. So, um, pretty simple song, you have to put a capo at the third fret, standard tuning, and uh, the chords are a lot like Let It Bleed. It reminds me a lot of, of it, of it, because it's the, basically the same chords, except for the, um, C7 chord. <laughs> but, um, let's see, uh, in the very beginning, though, it's, well, the, the song is in A, but in the beginning, it's going to start with a, this little lick in G. And it's going to modulate up to A. Um, but the, for that beginning lick... Uh, you're going to start with the third fret of the low E, and then hit the open... G string, hammer on at the second of the A, open D, four of the D, then it's, it's gonna, um, modulate up to A, this is what it's doing in the beginning before the verse starts. So what you're going to do is, um, first, this is the way the, that little lick goes. You start with the A string, you pluck the A, part of the A chord, and then you're going to do a hammer on first on the low E. A string. Like that. It does it three times and then you're going to go into the um, first verse. Okay, so for the main verses, it's just going to be going from a D, or from an A, and the way he's playing this A is with, you could either play it with your three fingers, like this, or if you can, you know, kind of bar it and keep it arched to keep, keep the high E string open, you have to keep the high E string open. Switch to a D. Sometimes you can lift your second finger or add your pinky. Um, so it's going to be, does that four times, an A to D, and then um, it's going to go from a D, stay on the D for a minute. So you're going to go from a D. Actually, I did that incorrectly just there because, well, it does go to E, but I think he's playing this E shape, like an E5. Back to the D, and then he does a little uh, lick like this. Sliding down with your two fingers, your first finger is going to be at the fifth, and your second finger is at the sixth. Move 
that shape down five, four, three, to D, and then A. Um, and he does that, that little lick toward the end of the song too, but he does it a little bit like in a different tempo. Does something like that at the end. Pretty simple song. Um, good one to strum on. Um, and I'm also a big fan of Ron Wood, of course, so I had to share that with you. Take care.